Mr. Speaker, for over 40 years, the Congressional Black Caucus has strengthened and enhanced the work of the People's House. It does so by carrying into this chamber the voices of millions of Americans who for too long in our history were voiceless. It represents millions of our citizens who contribute greatly to building our economy, defending our hard-won freedoms, and fighting for equal justice and equal opportunity for all of our citizens. The Congressional Black Caucus has been rightly known for a long period of time as the conscience of the Congress. And Mr. Speaker, since he arrived here seven years ago, um, our colleague and my friend, Emmanuel Cleaver, has been the conscience of the CBC. Representative Cleaver, as most of uh, us who serve with him know, uh, but many Americans might not know, wears multiple hats. He is not only the former mayor of Kansas City, Missouri, but he is also an ordained Methodist pastor. Pastor Cleaver is frequently called upon for uh, words to deliver at my whip meeting on Thursday mornings. I have said that they are the highlight of our week in many respects. Emmanuel Cleaver speaks to us about uh, humanity, about caring, about respecting each of our colleagues on either side of the aisle, of respect, respecting and honoring our responsibilities to our fellow citizens. In short, Emmanuel Cleaver, on a weekly basis, appeals to the best that is within us, to reflect the best that is America. Emmanuel Cleaver will shortly be succeeded as president of the CBC by Marsha Fudge from Ohio. Like Emmanuel Cleaver, a leader of conscience, a leader of great ability, and a leader who will reach out to all of us as well and continue to lead this organization that we know as the conscience of the Congress. As we talk about creating jobs, as we talk about caring for one another, as we talk about making life better for all Americans, there is no more compelling voice than the Congressional Black Caucus towards that end. And there has been no more compelling voice than that of my friend, Emanuel Cleaver. Emmanuel, I expect uh, your leadership to be enhanced as the days go by. But you have shown us an example of how one can serve with dignity, with grace, and with effectiveness. Thank you. I yield back the balance of my time.